Jack, congratulations. I think you thoroughly deserve that. Yeah, we did. Um, I've been saying it to the lads and family and that for a few days now. This is um, it's almost a must win for us. Um, you know, we've been frustrating and late and not quite firing, but this could have been a game that we'll go and win and really kickstart everything and bring that confidence and that and that performance that we kind of wanted. And um, you know, to to go down to ten men, you know, that even asks more questions of us in terms of character. Yeah, okay, then it's not quite the game plan that we want to play in terms of our style of football, but. You know, you've got to do what you've got to do at the end of the day. I thought the lads were were brilliant. Um, stepped up to fill up, you know, to fill in for Peter after the red card, and and just stuck at it. It was really, you know, gutsy, gutsy performance. Um, and then to you know to concede so early after half time was a bit of a you know soccer punch, but managed to um, to grind in. We went on and created more chances, and you know, testament to all the lads. It was a, a really solid performance, and I think one that we've been crying out for for a long time. So um, hopefully that can be something that really kicks us on now. And you made some crucial saves, not least before they scored down at your right-hand post. Great save. Yeah, no, it's, and I think it was nice that we restricted them to some uh, long-range efforts and stuff, and it was nice to be able to, you know, play my part and get a few saves in. Um, free kick was a bit disappointing. I didn't, I couldn't really see it, and then um, they do a good job of running across and, and didn't quite see it. So a bit disappointed with that one, but hopefully I made up for it elsewhere and, and the boys... You know, getting getting the two goals you know helped out as well. So um really enjoyable night. Conditions look tricky and that must make it difficult for a goalkeeper. Yeah, I mean especially with, with that ball in particular as well. Um, and you know, looking at the way that those you know, the Derby boys hit it, they've got some great strikers of the ball. So um, there's a few spicy ones coming in, a few wobbles on, but um, you know, it's what we practiced for and, and, and felt comfortable and, and uh, and really enjoyed the challenge and you know and then like I said back to the lads some last ditch blocks um, some really important defending and uh, it was a real team team win gutsy performance did you see the sounding off from where you were no nah, it's a difficult one I think um, I think it probably was um, but you know it, it kind of galvanized us it maybe riled them up a little bit you know you never like to, to, to lose a player or, or, or see a bad challenge but it's something that Peter will, will learn from and um, you know he's a, he's a top player that we need um, and thankfully we were able to step up and, and get a good win. What I thought was most pleasing tonight was the fact that we showed that we can win a battle. In, yeah. in fairness, is it fair to say we haven't shown that before this season but tonight we did? Um, no, I, don't, I, don't, I think we've been in some situations in games this season, two down, three down and we've shown that fight to, to come back and either tie it up or, or get back in the game. So I don't think it's a case of the, the fight being there. It, 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 it's starting off the game with the right tempo and making sure we assert ourselves on the game, which I felt we did tonight. And I felt we even did um, once we've gone down to 10. And, you know, I feel we showed some great ability to play out of the pressure when we did win it back. Sometimes it's got to be clear, but sometimes the lads showed, you know, initiative to, to get on the ball. And, and we ended up going up the other end and creating a few more chances. So, um that's what we're about. We've got that in us. Um, obviously, it's a difficult scenario going down to 10, um, but we've got that that in us. And um, like I said, hopefully this is a game that really kickstarts what we what we want to achieve. Um, and we've got to go to Reading on the weekend and win. Otherwise, uh, tonight doesn't feel quite as sweet. Yeah, but as you say, it's not just clearing it, is it? We, we took it out and kept it and yeah. kept control of it. And I, yeah. I thought that was superb. Yeah, I think, um, I think going down to 10 probably took the pressure off a little bit more. Almost people aren't expecting you to, to win the game as such. or So if anything, maybe took the pressure off a little bit. And, you know, our away record's been brilliant. I think at home we, we still play with that little bit of... A um, little bit of pressure, but if we go out and play like we, we did today, even after you know going down to ten, that's what we can achieve. So um, hopefully that's a little little kick in the backside to, to to our home form and really getting that flying. Um, and yeah, we'll, we'll be there or thereabouts definitely. And th this next Christmas period is is going to be really important. And it's a stepping stone for us, isn't it? If we use it right now, yeah. we, we can build from this. Yeah, it, we haven't had enough back-to-back -back wins. We've got to go on a run now of picking up good points and consistent points and um, like I said that's got to continue on the weekend we have to go to Reading and we, we've got to go and you know, win the game that's what we're about now we're not you know can't be settling for any you know silly little draws and stuff when we're in control of games or um, sometimes it's not going to be pretty sometimes you've got to grind them out like tonight but you know we've got to start winning games now and uh, we can't keep papering over things and um, we've got we're a, we're a good enough side 
believe we're the best side in the league, man to a man, and the quality that we have, we've got to start beating teams on a regular basis. And uh, I believe we can do that. And, and hopefully this, you know, this result tonight gives us that, gives everyone the belief that we can do it and the confidence to, to go on and do that. And there's still plenty of time, isn't there? Because it's not now that counts. It doesn't matter where we are on the table yeah, now. It's next May. <laughs> there is a long, long time to go. Um, this Christmas period is massive. Over a five, six game stretch, you can, you know, everyone knows how many points you can pick up. But it can be huge. Uh, you know, games coming thick and fast, back to back. You know, you put in a good Christmas period. You know, first of January, we could be sitting, sitting in a completely different position. So that's the challenge. Um, it's to build on, you know, a good win tonight and and push on.